We are volunteers for the National Museum of the Royal Navy. We are responsible for the latest restoration of a 114-year-old steamboat. She saw service in the Royal Navy and uh, she left the service in 1949, having been built in 1911. We are the crew of the vessel. Every 10 years she has to have a new boiler certificate and she failed, unfortunately, because the boiler was so old. So we decided to not only retube the, the uh, boiler, but as the vessel was 100 years old, we thought we would see what we could do to make her last another 100 years. It isn't until you open up an old vessel that you find out what's really wrong. The worst moment, I would think, was probably to do with the boiler, when we had great expectations and we realised that we actually couldn't do it. And then it was a question of really finding somebody who could do it and then finding the funds to pay them. What we have experienced whilst we've been doing this project really is the interest that the public has shown and how it's turned into almost a community feeling, a community spirit. And it's really sort of pulled everybody together. And the focus has been the work that we've been doing. We had a retired Vice Admiral who came across our project. He used to drive one of these boats as a midshipman years and years ago and suddenly came up and uh, posted some money into us just to help out. And absolutely brilliant. We've hit all sections of the community. We're so pleased with the support that we've had. We've had two major milestones. One was the finishing the hull, which was all the woodwork, the shipwriting work. And the other major milestone was getting the boiler retubed. They were the two really major milestones. Great evening, and we're very, very grateful for the, the recognition that we've achieved. It's uh, really quite something, yeah. actually. Wonderful day. Yep. We're, we're knocked out. Yeah. And we're going to hit the PR trail tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs>